Hey guys, how's it going? So ever since I got the CNC, I've been basically using my shop vac exclusively for dust collection. And because I have no separator there, it's basically clogging up the filters pretty quick. So I want to make something pretty simple and see how efficient we can get it without a whole lot of work. Now I got a pretty big bucket here and I also got this guy here which came with my shop vac. And I think that will actually make a pretty good inlet. So let's see what we can come up with. So now for the cover, which is a nice tight locking twist on style cover, I'm going to use this guy here, which is actually from my shop back too. It was like the long stick what came with it, which I've never used for anything. So I just cut it off short, put a little notch on it. And I'll just face that away from the inlet. There, that's it. I mean, that literally took me 20 minutes, so let's see how it works. I should know too that it's a two and a quarter inch inlet. That's what comes with my shop back, and the hose, what's going to the CNC, is inch and a quarter, so I do have an adapter for that. All right, so I got a nice clean bucket here. I'm going to take a couple scoops of this, weigh it and uh, we'll suck it up with the separator and weigh it after and see how much we captured at the separator. We'll zero this guy first. So 632. I'd have to go back and check the camera to see what it was before. I think it was 639, but I'll double check. So I just went back and checked the tape and it was actually 645. So we went we had 632 afterwards. Divide that by your 645 and 0.979 times a hundred. That's 97.98% efficient, which you can definitely make these things more efficient than that, there's no question. But for 20 minutes worth of work to get this guy, I'm pretty happy with that. I can live with that.